So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. Um, it's exactly about four lines long or so. So let's read it and see what information we can extract from what we read here. The mean score of eight players in a basketball game was 14.5 points. Okay, so I'm going to say that that means that we have A plus B plus C plus D plus E plus F plus G. Where are we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, plus H, all divided by eight is equal to 14.5. So hopefully that makes sense for uh, how I translated that first sentence. The letters here just represent the scores from the eight players because they don't tell us what those scores are. Um, obviously, if I'm finding the mean, the mean is the same as finding the average. So that's why I divide by eight because there are eight players and here is the actual mean score. Next sentence, if the highest individual score is removed, so let's just pretend like uh, these, this is in ascending order. So let's say H is the highest individual score. The mean score of the remaining seven players becomes 12. Okay, so A plus B plus C plus D plus E plus F plus G divided by seven is equal to 12. What was the highest score? So here, the question is just what was H? So because I have a lot of experience with these types of questions, what I recognize here, first of all, is I always set the questions up like this, right? So if this is new for you, please keep in mind, if a question is telling you that you're finding the average between some unknown values, just make some letters up um, to represent those values and just set it up as you would if you did know the numbers. So what does this tell me? Well, this tells me that I can simplify this. I can multiply both sides here by seven. And what I'm left with is that A plus B plus C plus D plus E plus F plus G is equal to, right, 12 times seven, which is 84. And now this is very valuable because I have this up here, right? It's the same. A plus B, C, D, E, F, G. So I can replace that with 84. So going back up to my original um, fraction here, I'm going to replace this with 84. Okay, let's do that over here. So that means instead of all those letters, I have 84. I still have plus H, right? Still divided by 8 is still equal to 14.5. So now I can multiply both sides here by 8. So 14.5 times 8 in my calculator is 116. So I have 84 plus H is equal to 116. I subtract 84 from both sides here, leaving me with H equals 32. And therefore, the correct answer here is choice C.